hosted by Black Entertainment Television. I really don't know what to say, but I think you're all wonderful people, and I love you so much, and thank you for everything. I love you more. Lisa Marie was a no-show, but the two were very much together on Sunday at the Memphis Zoo, right down the road from Graceland. And boy, does Lisa Marie look unhappy. Undercover at the zoo, but as you're about to see in these exclusive pictures, Michael's disguise wasn't fooling anybody. Roger Lodge has the details. Visitors at the Memphis Zoo got a glimpse at a rare American bird last Sunday, the elusive Michael Jackson, an endangered species. The gloved one was disguised as a masked one, wielding an umbrella. If you recall, at Disney World, Michael had a mustache. And at a Los Angeles doll convention, the discreet star was reportedly disguised as a mummy. Who wonder what he'll do for Halloween? The self-proclaimed king of pop was flanked by big, burly bodyguards, while an unhappy Lisa Marie and her children tagged along. Maybe Michael wouldn't buy his lovely wife a snow cone. Along with visiting the animals, Michael also rode the train. Hey, Michael, you're supposed to stay seated until the train comes to a complete stop. You should know better. You have a train just like that at your house. Well, Jackson did sign autographs for the few kids who weren't reportedly frightened away by the wandering mask superstar. Memphis Zoo officials said they had no idea that Michael was loose in the park. Looks like Michael's elaborate disguise did fool somebody, those park security people. Terry?